And for more on Good Friday, I'm joined by Archbishop of Lagos Methodist Church, uh, Nigeria, Most Reverend Isaac Olawi, who uh, joins me on the program. Uh, thank you for joining us on TV News at 7. Let's begin with what you consider the biggest lessons today on the day Jesus was crucified. Good evening. Thank you. Happy Good Friday. The lessons to, la to, to learn from this if the event of this of today, the Good Friday, as Nigerians, as Christian people, even people of other faiths, we should emulate it, the sacrificial life of Christ. Jesus came not thinking of himself, but of others. He, he emptied himself and gave his life for all others. His life of service, life of dedication, life of selflessness, selflessness. He served the world and even to the point of dying on the cross for the entire humanity. Absolutely. And that's perhaps, you know, what um, everyone is talking about, the need for Nigerians to make more sacrifice and become selfless. And, you know, the Good Friday is also the Easter celebration this year is happening at the same time. You know, Muslim faithful are also observing the Ramadan period. Talk to us about how we can see more of an impact of religion as a country on governance, on leadership, and day-to-day -day life of each Nigerian. Yes, the leaders should also emulate the life of Christ because especially what we are passing through at this time requires that every leader, political leader, even family leaders, church leaders, we should know that it's time for self-denial in so many ways. We should learn to deny self. We should think more of others. We should think of, of those who are not as uh, as able as we are. We may have lost um, connection with the arch.